I'm Jenny and this is Excel It. You see how she's already got body structure here? This she got trust issues. You, you want it big, you want it loud, clean, classic, or colorful, and fast, fast, fast. Oh my God. Well, how bad do you want it? I'm Jenny Long from Excel and I'm hitting the streets to bring some of our hottest product to you. Well, actually, that drink of water behind you. The only catch, an on-the-spot install. Take it or leave it, restyle for your ride. Ready? This is Excel It. come to me. San Antonio, founded in 1718. That's pre-America, people. A lot of history here. Frontier, cowboys, horses, and a lot of horseless carriages around these parts. And the one we're after is from a maker with a long history as well. Think you can guess? It's listed right there. While you work on that, I'm gonna check out this city in a montage. Uh, four years in April. Really? Four years? So let's meet our target. Do you remember those eight years between 2002 and 2010? Nothing really was happening, at least not if you're Chevy. Kind of the dark ages. Something was missing. What was it? That's right. Where was the Panther? Yeah, that's almost what they named the Camaro. Good thing that didn't happen, right? This car was Chevy's answer to the biggest, baddest horse on the road in the 60s, the Mustang. And since then, the Camaro's outpaced it, literally, by being named the official pace car of the Indy 500 more times than the Mustang. The bitching Camaro we're working with is from the fifth generation and is owned by Jacob Wilhite, a true Texan who's been cutting his teeth in the garage since he was 16. Jacob, hey, Jenny from Excel. Hey, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. How are you doing? I'm good. I heard that if you aren't at your own shop, you're here with these guys. Yeah, you know, just kind of BS and I had a little bit of free time today, so just came to talk to Danny and he owns Lethal and I just came to see what kind of projects he's got going on. Well, we got your posts on social okay. and I got some awesome products for your car. Oh, that Yeah? Is. So obviously, since you don't have anything going on today, we're gonna be doing some installation. Cool. Okay? Yeah. But I'm first, I kind of want you to give me a tour. Yeah, sure. Come on, I'll show you around. All right, let's do it. Uh, this is a 14 Mustang they got on. It's got a Paxton Supercharger. A nice twin turbo. Vet that hurt a lot of feelings. <laughs> <laughs> hurt a lot of feelings. Yeah. And this is Tim. Hey, Tim. I'm Jenny. Nice to meet you. Hi, nice to meet you. Uh, I love what you guys have going on here. Thank you. Can you tell me a little bit about it? Basically, we're an all domestic shop. We work on Corvettes, Camaros, Mustangs, Challengers, Chargers. Basically, if it's American, we'll slap a turbo on it, supercharger, and we'll make it go fast. What are you guys working on today? Uh, well, right now, I'm doing long tubes and exhaust on a 2014 Dodge Challenger. My buddy Jack right here is doing a twin turbo kit on a C5 Z06. And then Sean's dynoing a supercharged 2014 Mustang right now. What would you say is the fastest car you guys have worked on that's out there on the streets? Um, I would definitely have to say Castillo's Vet. Uh, it's a 2009 Cyber Gray Z06 Corvette. It puts around 1,500 horsepower to the ground. Yes, yeah. and he runs it on the street. Okay, that's pretty fast. Oh, very, very <laughs> scary fast. Well, hey, thanks for the tour. It looks awesome. Yes, ma'am, anytime. Come see us again. All right, thank you. Mm -hmm. That's the Grey Ghost. Let's see what's under the hood. We got a few goodies. Okay, obviously some modifications. Ah, uh, just a few. Yeah. It's a LS3 with a Patrick Guerra custom cam, D1 SE Pro Charger, and then full American Racing headers, and puts down about 720 to the ground, so. Wow. It, it'll put the beans to it. Maybe. Yeah, it'll put the beans to it. All yeah. right, I like that. I'm gonna use that. The only thing I think that would make this look a little bit better is a little bit of yellow in there. I, I think I can use yeah. a little bit of yellow, spice it up a little bit. Let's get to work here. Okay. Let's do it. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, so we have our super coils and wires. Let's jump right in there. 
Now with the ceramic boot, this is gonna be awesome because I'm sure this thing puts off a lot of heat. Yeah, especially with the supercharger, with those ceramic tips, it'll definitely be a huge yeah. improvement. So air filter first, yeah. right? Oh, thanks. Thanks for letting me jump in here. No, to say ladies first. <laughs> That's right. It's nice to know you have some manners. So, Jacob, why the Camaro? Uh, it's the American muscle car, you know, Ford versus Chevy, and I've always been a big Chevy fan. Really? You know, through and through. Are you the best friend for all your friends? Like, everyone comes to you when they have yeah, car problems. Yeah, everyone comes to me, so I mean, I, I try and help everyone out, give them a helping hand, because you can catch more flies with honey than you can vinegar. <laughs> We're such a good team, Jacob. Mm -hmm. Are you hiring? Like I'm always looking for good help. You know, good help's hard to find these days. I can do an interview right now. <laughs> What would you say is the uh, fastest that you've ever ridden in a car? 224. Where did you drive that fast? <laughs> Let's just say south of the border, you know. <laughs> Somewhere you like to say in Mexico. Okay. This is going to give you 15% more spark energy than your stock coils. It's going to be a direct OEM replacement upgrade. It's going to give you better performance, quicker starts, and faster throttle response and acceleration. All right, let's start her up. So, let's take this thing for a ride. Let's go. Okay. You ready? I'm ready. Let's go. SH-130, speed limit's 85 mile an hour. So what do people usually drive on it? Every bit of 85, if not more. <laughs> Maybe 90? Oh yeah. <laughs> so this Camaro, what uh, what kind of history has it had? It, it's fairly quick, it'll definitely hold its own. Yeah. It, it'll put some hurt on some people. Definitely, definitely beat up on a lot of Mustangs. <laughs> oh, those sound like fighting words. Hey, Chevy till I die. <laughs> So would you say you are a domestics only kind of guy? Or do you like imports as well? I like imports. Like if I had an import, just make it quick, mess around with, have fun, you know, unless it's a Honda. <laughs> so what do you think of Texas? You know, I love it. I love Texas so far. Have yeah. you been in two-step bars? You got any favorites? No, I haven't been two-stepping ever. What? I know. Well, we're gonna have to fix that. It's a little bit nerve-wracking. It's not bad. It's All right, it's easy. I'm here. Ah! Our hats keep touching. I'm going to show you something. This is your window. Can you see how she's already got body structure here? This she's got trust issues. I do. It's so sad. I know. Slow. Slow. Quick. Quick. Slow. All right. All right. I'm going to do this. Click the link below and don't forget to subscribe.